time has come. The hairless XL bullies are officially in the door. We in there like swimwear, and we don't care what y'all got to say. Everybody got an opinion. Some people like it, some people hate it. It don't matter. They here to stay. Let's go ahead and get into this video. We got litters getting ready to drop. Shout out to everybody in our investment program, man. It's finna go down. This is what I've been talking about. I'm working behind the scenes. Man, these XL hairless bullies, they're going for 150000 that's the standard price, hundred and fifty thousand right now. The per, the value for them is very very high, and this is what I've been telling y'all about. Man, I'm out here making moves behind the scenes. The next big thing that I'm finna pop out with is the fluffy XL bully. It's finna go down, man. I'm taking a lead from the Frenchies, man. The Frenchies is the number one breed right now in the world, and the reason why is because they innovators. They're not afraid to change. They out here making moves for their breed, and they lining up their pockets, and they they sitting right. I know some new time breeders that just got into the fluffies and they're making like 50k off of a litter because why? Why are they doing that? Because they're not afraid to innovate, they're not afraid to move forward. And that's what I'm doing for the XL Bully community. Whether y'all like it or not, I'm going to be the front runner. I don't really care about what y'all feel about me, what y'all got to say about how we doing stuff. I'm one of the ones that want all the smoke. I don't care about nothing y'all got to say. We going full speed ahead. The hairless bullies are here. Next is the fluffies. We going full speed ahead, and who knows? After that, it may be some something else. I got in. I got in mind. But yeah, shout out to everybody. all the Frenchie breeders, y'all leading the way, showing us how to go and get the bag. We going. We going to get the bag. We don't care about none of that. We going. We don't care about none of that. At the end of the day, this is a business. At the end of the day, this is a business. We going to get the bag. Shout out to my investors. If you're not invested, you can invest into one of our leaders and receive a profit up to you know, 15 up to 15 or 16k probably more than that man the next big thing i'm gonna do is uh something special for my investors yeah i'm gonna go get a bag that's what i've been trying to tell y'all man just hold on be patient let me work let me work let me go get that bag for y'all let me go get it because i'm gonna go get it and come back with it every time that's what i've been trying to tell y'all this is exactly what i've been trying to tell y'all so shout out to all y'all who've been loyal staying faithful Understanding the process, man. It's gonna go down. OG Glam family, we're gonna take over, man. We got the XL hairless bullies available, man. They're available, but you gotta come with the bag because this is a real business investment. I don't care if you just now starting off or you've been in the game. The opportunity of a lifetime is knocking at your door right now because it's only five of them. It's only five. Only five XL bullies hairless in the world. It's only five. And those five are going to go quick. Whoever gets their hands on those five, they're going to pretty much lead the new wave. And they're going to get a bag. Because not only are the puppies going for 150K plus, I'm going to say plus, their offspring will go for 150K and probably even more because they're going to be even more highly sought after. And still, at the same time, they're going to be still rare. There's only five. And they'll, out of those five, they'll probably produce maybe 20 puppies. And that's still, like, not a lot of hairless when you're talking about dogs and all of that. So, whoever gets their hands on these dogs, man, y'all pockets going to be lined up. And if you're a real breeder, you're going to put majority of that money back into your kennel. So, your kennel going to be fire as hell. Like, if, if whoever gets their hands on these dogs is going to be crazy. Yeah, it's, This is a life-changing moment for people out there who really trying to change their life, who really trying to do it. So, yeah, the price is high, but at the same time, it's very low for the return that you're getting ready to get. Because the gene for the hairless is dominant. You don't need two hairless to breed in order to get uh, more hairless. You don't need each dog to have hairless on uh, each side of the pedigree. The gene is dominant, just like the Merles. You don't need two Merles. You really can't breed two Merles together. All you need is one dog with the Merle gene, and then the Merle gene is going to uh, create after its own. Same thing with the hairless. The hair, hairless gene is dominant, so it don't matter what you breed it to. It's going to go, and it's going to create another hairless. So, uh, shout out to everybody. Uh, let's go ahead and show y'all these fire hairless XL American bullies. Let's go! Now they already got names. They already got names. And my favorite one, I'm gonna show y'all my favorite first. This is my favorite. His name is Freddy Cougar. And I think it's 
a perfect name for him. Y'all know Freddy, his face is kind of like burnt up and he's showing, you know, flesh. All his, you know, hairlessness is in the full effect. And he's probably the biggest out the litter. That man is fire. He's a true XL, true hairless, and he's a blue tri. All the puppies are blue tries. All the puppies are blue tries. And he is fire. It's my favorite one. And uh, if y'all want him, y'all got to come with the bag. And how do y'all pay for these dogs? Let's say you don't have 150. You may not have 150, but you probably know a couple of people who have 50K, 50K, 50K. Guess what? Y'all partner up. And y'all can knock out that price. I know that's how they was paying for the hairless. This is like I said, this is a business opportunity. So you gotta approach it with a business mindset. So they was coming together for the people who uh and even if you do have it, it's always good to have a team around you to that's focused on one goal. You can accomplish a lot better, a lot more things a lot faster with the team around you. So whether you have it all or if you partner up, it's ways to get this done. And, and it's way, it, like it's more than one way to skin a cat. <laughs> like that's what that's what they say. I don't say that because I ain't skinning no cats. But it's more than one way. And then and then it's more than one way to get you uh, your hands on a fluffy. I mean not a fluffy. The fluffies are coming though. It's more than one way to get your hands on a hairless XL American bully. So like I said, Freddy Cougar, he fires hell. I love everything about this boy. Man, he's big. He's also a tri carrier. So I'm just kind of, uh, and he's a blue, he's a hairless blue tri. So I'm just kind of curious to see how that's going to look when they, when it's, they're being bred more and then they, you take them to a chocolate or a lilac. I, I'm, I'm curious to see how those colors, you know, show itself on the hairless because the, the pigmentation. Uh, for the hairless, they still have some type of color to it, and they still have a little bit of hair. So I'm just curious on how it's gonna look. Now, as far as the structure and then the uh, um, bully look, that's gonna come with time. This isn't the, as you can tell, this is their. They aren't first generation hairless. Uh, it's being kept low on the low, and uh, they're not the first generation. I'm not gonna say which generation it is because I don't want the cat to be out the bag, but it took time to get this done it wasn't an overnight thing oh we gonna go and do this and do that nah this was they're bred properly they have no health issues for everybody who out there saying this and that they don't have health issues so yeah it's gonna go down now the next one is yoda and yoda is hard if y'all been following us on instagram y'all saw yoda was the first picture that we posted and his name is yoda his structure is there he got a wide chest, a wide frame. He's going to be more compact. I think he's going to be shorter than uh, uh, Freddy, than Freddy, but he's still an XL and he's beautiful, man. He is ideal for what we want them to look like. I mean, he's he's nice, he's beautiful, and uh, it it, it looks like he's not a first generation. Like I said, he he's everything on what we uh imagined them to be. So. If y'all want him, I believe he's the first pick male. So his price is going to be higher than 150. So hit me up. 832-95. No, 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 no. 832-745-2139. 832-745-2139. And uh, we're going to talk about the price. But yeah, it's five of them. And so that was the first two males. So I'm going to go ahead and do the only girl. And so the girl, obviously, since it's only one, her price is going to be valued higher than 150 So y'all have to get with me on the price on her. And she is fire as hell. Let me go and get her. Her, This is G.I. Jane. She's fire. Fire, 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 fire. And so y'all know you got to approach it differently when you're getting a female because she's going to have the puppies versus a stud. Uh, you know, with the stud, you just you know studying the dog out. But with the female, it's kind of a little better situation because you don't really need a male. You can just use a stud fee. Like I think it'll be fire to take her to like one of the top studs in the game right now. Like imagine her going to uh Bossy's um Good Bar, or imagine her going out there in the UK to Enzo. Imagine her going to one of those 
top studs in producing a nice structurally built American bully. So I guess a lot that comes with this and uh you're gonna go and get a bag if, if you get one of these dogs you're gonna go and get a bag i'm telling you right now your pocket's gonna be lined up your kennel gonna be fired and you're gonna be on fire because you're gonna be like damn he got they got one they got one of them dogs like damn they, and, and then you're gonna be the, the only ones in the world to have them because nobody else has them y'all know <laughs> Man, I'm so happy to be out here pushing these puppies, man. I'm excited, man. I hope y'all feel the excitement through the video, man. They fire as hell, man. Like, it's amazing. Like, they said it couldn't be done. And look at it. We, we've been a bust 2024 wide open. Check us out, man. Hold up, man. Let me, go, let me get the other one for you. So this boy right here, his name is Ghoulam. And he is like a smoky, gray, very 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 unique boy he's a like a dark smoky gray and i love the way he looks he's definitely going to be bully he's going to be more compact he may even be more on the 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 standard size maybe but he's definitely going to be right there on that mark between a big standard and a uh uh the average size xl but as far as the compactness man he's going to be what you want he's gonna have that bully look and uh their ears are being cropped so don't worry about that they'll come with their ears cropped already so you won't have to worry about that and like i said they're fully healthy active puppies very healthy it, this process wasn't rushed so everything was done right so yeah this is this boy is fire man you can tell by the way they look so regardless of what people are saying Oh, this is that. This is this is that. Right now, the XL Bully game is down. So this is going to. Uh, this is a fresh start. This is going to rejuvenate a lot of things. It's going to put money in the in the market again. And so, I don't see why everybody is so upset and afraid to change. What whatever the case is, I don't know. Some people just talking just to talk. But yeah, it it is what it is. And so yeah, we definitely. Got something for y'all. And last but not least is the freakiest one of them all. If y'all looking for that shock, that wild wow factor, that's why we saved him for last. His name is E.T. That boy is freaky. And he's going to be probably the most freakiest looking hairless in the market, in the game. He has that shock, that wow factor. He's probably going to produce the same thing after his kind. And he's going to give you all that very rare, uh, freaky looking hairless. And it's beautiful. Like, he's, he's unique. And he's going to be wonderful. All of them are good family pets. They have no temperament issues. Even as puppies, they're loving. Just like American bullies should. They're all loving. The parents are all loving. I know that's the big question. Who are the parents? Who are the parents? That's for another video. Right now, we can't give out the sauce on how we did it because that's going to bring the value down. That's going to bring the value down on what we got going. And so we're not just finna pop out and show y'all like, oh, this is how we did this and that. We're not finna get a blueprint. Come on now. Come on now. Why, we gonna, why would we give the blueprint? That's why when you go to these restaurants, and, and you have these corporations and these businesses, they have y'all sign these uh, clauses. And why is that? That's that way you can't you can't tell the blueprint without being sued. And it's a reason for that. We got to keep it right here. So we'll reveal on who the mom and dad is, and only to the serious buyers. But right now, we're not doing that right now. So we're going to leave a lot of speculation. It's people saying this, saying that. And they don't have a clue on how we did it. They don't have a clue. The, the, the a majority of them are all the way off. Uh, all, all the way off. So we're not showing the parents just yet. We're not finna drop the sauce. Because I already know. The smart people are going to be trying to buy the mom and dad. But we're not finna do that. We're not selling them. We're not doing that. <laughs> Nah, we're not giving up the sauce, man. We we keeping it on the low. But yeah, the next big thing, y'all hearing it right now out of my mouth, what we working on is the fluffy XL American bully. So 
Y'all better get with the program, man. And I'm finna go on a little rant on Instagram, and I'm finna fire up a whole bunch of people that's trying to gatekeep in the XL American Bully uh, community, and they ain't did nothing for the community besides talk. <laughs> These people been saying they been breeding for 10, 20 years, but nothing to show for besides some comments that they left under somebody's post who's actually doing something and trying to better the community. So it is what it is, man. This is the first introduction of the hairless XL American bully, man. Get with it or get lost. If you want one, you got to pay the cost, man. Y'all heard it live from your boy, Ultra Class Family, man. We the leaders of the new school, man. We the youngest that's at the top of the game right now. We the youngest, <laughs> but we are coming for that number one spot. So go run and tell whoever y'all got to tell that we finna raise hell. We coming for that number one spot. And we don't care if y'all like the way we moving or not. We don't give a damn. Because at the end of the day, what you say don't matter. We don't give a damn about what you got to say. We don't care if you, we really don't care if you like it or don't like it. At the end of the day, what you have to say about us or any other kennel who's out here doing stuff, y'all don't move us. We don't give a damn. You can say what you want. 